Okay, we're going to look at a forum called, that I used to post on called, regularly, called islamicawakening.com. And the thread itself is forums.islamicawakening.com slash f18 slash Syria thread four zero rules before six seven eight six two. I just want to how the forum was actually banned, and the post that I posted on it between January of twenty fourteen and August twenty fourteen. I can't remember exactly what. Somewhere between at least between uh, February and June of 2014 it's actually more than that but yeah if we go to 2014 and then search November open it in a new link you notice that pages between somewhere around 20 and 40 and a few more have been specifically deleted despite the fact that they were questioning the identity of the people who had attacked Syria and caused chaos there and whether they were Blackwater operatives or not since Eric Prince had moved to the place but the questioning seems seem to have been you either support Islamic State or you support Assad. And the British, French and American um, operations there and activities were just not mentioned. Again, as you see, it's 2013 that we're being shown. The end of 2013 that we're being shown here. Uh, 15th of November 2013. Page 13. Syria 4.9 thread. Nepalar. Bridging the Dino Bot. I'm pretty sick. I don't look sick. Let's move to page 15. Shows us 78 pages when they're really over 103. I don't know how that works, but it's there anyway. 23rd of November 2013. Let's move to page 25 now. 17, let's go to 17 first. So again, no date, three days ago. I moved on to three days ago. Despite the fact that we were still in November or December of 2013. So what's happened here is page 17, it's ended there. What's happened here is that I was banned from the forum after asking about Ansara Mujahideen forums. And then within a month or so, The uh, forum itself was closed down. And now that I've gone back onto Web Archives, Wayback Machine, we find that those specific posts regarding ISIS and Blackwater, questioning who exactly was behind the chaos there. And I had actually said that, yeah, it's, I believe that the and it's a genuine Islamic State should be established and people would argue with me as to whether I was a Khariji or whether I was a Bashar supporter or whether I was a um, extremist terrorist but the fact that I was seeking to establish simply the laws of God as enshrined in the Quran and as 
speaking of that, it was just ignored totally every single time it was argued. Do you support Islamic State or not? ISIS or not? Not even Islamic State, ISIS. And I said, if ISIS are establishing a genuine Islamic State, then I do support them. If they're not, then no, I don't. But no one wanted to, well, certain people just appeared did not want to hear that. They wanted to continue arguing about whether you support Bashar al-Assad or you support ISIS. Despite the fact that we know that secularist British soldiers have been reported by secular news pieces, including the, uh, I think, Independent, no, Express, the Daily Express, where British SAS people were actually going into Syria with Islamic State flags and uh, carrying out attacks in the region. And her Twitter accounts had been traced back to the British government, the Department of Work and Pensions. See, let's move to page, say for instance, 55. Okay. There it is. That's the one. There's a lot of slander through association. This kind of thing was um, actually promoted. But the actual facts themselves on what we should be doing was ignored. saying goes, some see things as they are and say why, and some see things as they should be and say let's get it right, but to see things as they are and say why was uh, entertained as they should be and say let's get it right, it appears was not, hell, um, Let's move on to page 102, which should be there. So when we see these secularist groups claiming that some of these forums promote extremism and stuff, we saw the same with Malcolm X, where they around him and made him the, the enemy they loved to hate as long as he was playing the game the uh, black or white game as soon as he went to pilgrimage and saw the truth and started speaking about speaking up inviting everyone with a black or white to the truth he got shot on the first year We see history repeating continually. Some people were speaking up and they were coming around to the truth. But that's around where it ended, around the time where it ended. So 
So yeah, probably got an idea of what happened there. That was the last one, November. Anyways, 